Hey YouTube. Well, I'm back from New York. Quite a crazy week with uh, the implementation and rollout of 5G uh, for our airline this week. Um, quite a bit of a controversy around it too. For those of you interested in the subject, uh, some people have even asked me to make a video about my perspective on the 5G rollout. Obviously my perspective is a little bit more from an engineer and an airline perspective than perhaps from the uh, telecommunication company's perspective. Uh, but broadly, I can say it was not handled well by either the FCC or the FAA, and uh, the telcos and the airlines obviously also have their parts in it. Um, but there are two very good arguments on both sides. But kind of being a technical person and working in a very regulated and I'll say sometimes bureaucratic industry, I can feel the frustration and the um, difficulty in understanding why things can't be fixed, but uh, things just don't move fast in the airline industry. We're flying aircraft that are certified, uh, approved by a, a government regulator, and even if we wanted to fix our radar altimeters, uh, it would take years uh, to make something like that happen, and the speed of 5G technology just isn't moving at that pace, but I think that broadly encapsulates the issue. Uh, I want to make a shout out to one of my viewers that uh, reached out. His name is Muna. Hey Muna, thanks for watching the videos. Appreciate your support of the channel. But what we are going to do today is just some unprotected lefts uh, that many of you are familiar with. This is a uh, version 10.9. This is uh, one of my first drives on it because it was installed after I had to leave town. So version 10.9 and we will see how it goes. Let me get the uh, cameras all rolling and take it for a spin. Here we go. See how this looks. A little bit of a lean to the right. Needs to creep a little bit more. Needs to stop. There's a truck coming. Okay. There's a truck. <laughs> and it was proceeding. So that was not comfortable. It was giving a commit acceleration there. It may have stopped again, but it, it would have been in the road if it had. So uh, round one on 10.9 on protected left. Try to run in front of a truck. We'll try some more. All right, take two. Stop line. Slow creep, please. Needs to stop there. There's a car coming and a nice gap here on both the left and the right. This should be easy. It should just go. A little bit of hesitancy. There's the commit. Straight through the median. No stop. That was good. Uh, obviously, the maneuver completed with uh, one little pause and then uh, two nice big gaps. That was a successful one. We'll try another one. All right, this is number three. I gotta pay attention to the road there because I was looking at my screen. Nice big gap here. All right, and it stopped. Where's it gonna go here? All right, it stopped. Okay, I'm in the road. There's a big gap on the left, but this is where it decided to stop and wait. It did not use the median. So that was a fortunate example. I don't know if you can see the cars were not coming from the left, so I was able to just let it decide there, but it is not using the median like I had sort of hoped the release notes implied. That was a little disappointing. I was, I'm glad I was able to let it go, but uh, no median usage in 10.9. And another one. Slow creep, slower. All right, big gap on the left. I can do anything. Let's see, see where it waits on the right. Okay, so now it's open both. So it started to creep. It didn't go into the middle of the road this time to wait. Uh, so there was a little bit of a gap it needed to wait for on the right. It proceeded a little bit, stopped, and then uh, went all the way. That's definitely its preferred scenario. Clear on the left, clear on the right, cross all the traffic, no stopping in the median. When it has those conditions, it does it just fine. It's got the acceleration and the turning radius down, it feels like. I'm not in love with this creep right now, but maybe it's just me getting used to it. And another one. Uh, 
gonna be careful not to get any more nags. I know looking at the screen to get this set up is a little bit of a temptation. Okay, it needs to wait. It's a little bit of a gap there. I mean, a, a, an aggressive driver could have gone, but I had to go to the median. Okay, now there's a good gap on the left and on the right, so it should go all the way through. That's the scenario it likes right there. No problem. Yeah, it's a it's an oncoming traffic decision uh, issue still. Uh, when it's got nice gaps and it, and it can see them and safely go, it, it's doing that just fine. And another one. Let's see how this one looks. I have a feeling the traffic's just a little bit light today, so it's going to be a lot of... Oh, there's some good traffic. Got to stop for these few cars. And it looks like there's a nice gap to the left, but it's got a busy to the right. So, oh, there's another car that snuck up there. It can't go now. Nope, two more cars. Now it can't go for both of them. It's still creeping, but it's slowly creeping. It's safely creeping. Now we got a nice big gap on the left and the right. It should go all the way. Go. Go. Now it's almost too late. Now if it goes now, I'm going to stop it. Oh, just nudging out there like a little bit of a tiny creep. But it didn't go, and there's the gap. Okay, that was good. That, that time, I'm, I'm happy with it. It's timing on the on the creep. I'm happy with the way it it made the decision not to overgo one of those without a strong commit. It, there were a couple in there. An aggressive driver could have gone to the median. It's not using medians. It waited. It waited with a little bit of a creep each time, and then it found its gap. And, and fortunately, it worked on both sides. Okay, I think I'm going to end on that one. I think that was a good, uh, a good drive. Um, I'm, you know, it's getting a little better, but it's not solved the problem at all yet. It's not using the median. Those release notes that, that were a little bit of a teaser on, on how much improvement we might expect were a little bit of a letdown that it didn't try to do anything uh, different in the median. It just waited there in the road. Um, I think the creeping behavior is continuing to evolve. I'm not sure it's 100% uh, getting better every time. But I think, uh, I think it was better. So we'll chalk that up to the unprotected left for version 10.9. Let me know what you think of the comments. I haven't had a whole lot of time to talk about the display and the other things going on. Another shout out to Muna if you watched this far. This video is for you, buddy. Have a great day, everybody.